Bitch, I'm smoking zuka, this ain't Zaza Bitch, I'm smoking zuka, this ain't Tuka Run up on me, tryna be a shooter Here we go! Who's that with y'all, my peeps? I'm back with another video, and today we got Lil Peep, Lil Tracy, and Slug Christ. I got the feature this time. I made sure I got the feature. I ain't forget the feature. You know what I'm saying? I got y'all. But we do got Lil Peep today. You know what I'm saying? And I had a pleasant surprise last night. I was playing Fortnite, and I usually always turn the radio off on Fortnite, but I had the radio on because they wouldn't let me turn it off. And why the fuck does bro why the fuck does fortnite have lil peep on there not him the character but his song they had beamer boy on there i was driving on there and beamer boy came on i thought it was my phone going off i'm looking for my phone and shit and i realized it was on the game in the vehicle and i was like they fucking won on no game they have peep bro fortnite i think fortnite is the first game to have Lil Peep on there, bro. That shit blew my damn mind. I was fucking ecstatic. I was excited. I was screaming and shit. I felt like a damn fangirl. You know what I'm saying? She was amazing, though. I ain't gonna lie. That shit was a pleasant damn surprise last night. A little last gift from Gus I had. You know what I'm saying? So shout out to Fortnite, bro. Shout out to Fortnite for uh, putting Gus in there and showing some love to Peep, bro. I definitely fuck with Fortnite because of that. That made me fuck with Fortnite 10 times harder. But... Besides that, y'all know I listened to Porn Stash in a long time. I listened to motherfucking Mr. Mustache, Cash Stash, Tracy in a long ass time. That thick ass fucking mustache. This is a lyric video, so we ain't gonna see the mustache, but that mustache is always gonna stick in my head. But anyway, man, we about to get into it, man. Tree of Wisdom. Um, the water's still clean, bro. But it is the color of this bong. It's going to make the water look a little different. The water looks a little greenish. But trust me, bong's good. The bong's good. I don't want to hear it. It's time to hit the bong for the headers, though, man. Let's get it. Let's get into it. Three, two, one, go. Slug Christ. This one was... <laughs> My bad. My bad, before I get into it, this one was highly requested. Just wanna let y'all know. This one was highly requested. Somebody put this in the comments. They comment got 22 likes. So that shit definitely got my attention. <laughs> <coughs> I'm telling you, I fuck with Gus so much that I can I can just pick up on the melody now. It's like eventually, like listening to Suicide Boys enough, you can eventually do the D Dudley D Dudley, even if you don't know what he's saying specifically. Or if you got the lyrics, you can do it. If you got the lyrics, you can literally sing along, bro. That's why I fuck with lyric videos. Cause without the lyric video, I wouldn't even be able to just sing this shit along. But I like it. And, and Gus be going hard with that shit, man. People be going hard with that shit, man. Ain't nobody fuck with him in, his, in the vocals. Like, literally, dude can try to sing just like him, same, like, melody, you know what I'm saying, same flow. But it's literally impossible to sound like this, man. It's crazy how he sounds like this music is perfectly fitted for him. This shit should be called peak genre. It should be called peak radio. Lil Peep radio. He's got a lot of cocaine, girl, you don't. No, my name. If I got out of way in the rain, girl, you don't know my pain. In my pocket's got a lot of 
Whoa. Whoa. Definitely Chase's hardest verse. So far, definitely Chase's hardest verse, lyrically especially. Like, whoa, what? Definitely the beginning, how the bait, how the beat dropped on his shit for hey. Alright, Tracy. He definitely slept though, cause this verse ain't ass. This is his best verse so far. You know what I'm saying? And this this song don't even got that many views for real. But this is his best verse so far, bro. <laughs> Girl, you don't know my pain. In my pockets, got a lot of cocaine. Girl, you don't know my name. Really did his pockets full of cocaine tattoos on my face. I'm gonna die this way. I don't want a job, so I flex and I finesse. Only inhale the best, exhale the stress. Used to be broke, I cast a spell on my check I saw my neck, now my ex sent me text Ask me if I still love her, I'm on Zans, I forget Ooh. Bitch, did you forget? You cut through me like a wrist Bro, bro. I'm finna get rich, His verse is so His verse is good as fuck, bro I'm fucking with this song Hopefully, Slug Christ don't fuck it up You know what I'm saying? I'm, hope, I'm hoping Slug Christ go hard, too I know people gonna go hard. Tracy go hard. I'm just hoping Slug Christ do not fuck the song up. You know, I never heard him, so I don't know what to expect by him. But these these two peeping, Tracy, they ran this song. They running this shit. Cocaine tattoos on my face. I'm gonna die this way. I don't want a job, so oh. I flex and I finesse. Only inhale the best. Exhale the stress. Used to be broke, I cast a spell on my check. I saw my neck, now my ex sent me text. Ask me if I still love her, I'm on Zans, I forget. Bitch, did you forget? You cut through me like a wrist. I'm finna get rich, snoring coke in the bins. You don't know my name, you don't know my pain. On the highway to hell, in a beamer switching lanes. 666 kisses on your face Baby, now that I'm gone Do you hallucinate And see me in your room With that Gucci on my waist I'm so far away Now I'm in LA Gothic bitch, skinny waist Pussy dripping like cocaine yeah, yeah. If I got out in the rain Girl, you don't Know my pain Girl, you don't know my name. If I got out in the rain, girl, you don't know my pain. In my pockets, got a lot of cocaine. Girl, you don't know my name. Yeah, she talking got me sodden in shame. Girl, you drive me insane. Okay. Sluggish cars ain't fuck it up. <laughs> he ain't do bad. I'll give him a six. A six is that good. Pretty average. 
what I'm saying? <laughs> I give him five. Be the average. But Tracy and Pete ran that bitch. Tracy for real ran that motherfucker. I gotta give it to Tracy on that one. I did not see that coming. I did not see that coming. Cause y'all know Tracy like I be wanting, I be hoping the best for Tracy, but his verses don't always be like that. He went bar for bar on that one, bro. That's what I be wanting. Cause I be like, bro, really like I've been in the studio. I've been, I've been there. I've been writing this shit. And I understand if you just freestyle this all the time, and I, you can still come up with some better shit. But if you <laughs> really making the song, bro, how I mean, niggas be on drugs and shit, so it'd be a lot of different shit that ties into this. But still, at the same damn time, how can you literally write music and and write some trash? Like read that shit back and just know that shit's ass and put it out. Or knowing it's not the best, or knowing you could have said something better, or just, or just knowing these bars don't relate. How do you put that out? How do you go in the studio and just put that out? I don't understand how some people would just do that. I personally don't understand. That's not why I probably just couldn't. I'm too picky on music. I'm too like, when I make music, if I'm making music, I'll be too picky on my bars. I feel like I gotta say something better. I got this gotta be better. And that's probably why. If I was to make music, that should probably be great. Because I'm picky as fuck with that shit. But anyway, I'm out this motherfucker, man. O2.